Oh, hey guys, uh, welcome to a uh, mock rig tutorial uh, using Python to uh, do 3D graphs. And I'm going to use the uh, SimPy package. So I'm going to start off by um, loading the packages that I need to do my graphs. So I'll start off with the plotting package. So from SimPy. Right, so as I say, this um, I'm loading the package to plot 3D graphs. So anything after um, the hashtag doesn't get read by Python, so it just ignores it. And this is just basically telling uh, somebody who's reading my script uh, what I'm doing as well. Then I need to also import the SimPy package. So from SimPy, import. That's right. Done, and then now um, I need to do some. Um, I need to um, assign some symbols that I'm going to use for my um, equations and all that. So I'm going to use the normal stuff that we use, you know, your x, y, z kind of thing. So I'll start off with w, x, y, and z. Right, so my first equation um, is going to be um, x squared plus y squared. So here we go, so plot 3D x squared, sorry, plus y squared. And then my ranges are going to be um, minus 15 to 15 and then same for y right so here we are All right. so here's our graph uh, for uh, x squared plus y squared with the ranges of minus 15 to 15 on both axes x and y axes Right, so that's um, that's our three D graph for x squared plus y squared. Um, you can also um, do the same plot without putting any ranges, and then Python just um, it just gives you uh, it just uses uh, ranges from minus ten to ten. So this is what I mean. So if I do it this way. It will just do uh, from minus 10 to 10 automatically. So here we are, so minus 10 to 10. Yep. Right, so now I'm going to plot um, the square root of um, x squared plus y squared, another pl uh, 3D plot. Right, um, like I said earlier on, if you want to be specific with your ranges, you just do what I've done here. But if you don't put anything, it will automatically uh, do it from minus 10 to 10. So here we are. And that's our 3D plot for the square root of x squared plus y squared. Yep. Right, then um, I'm going to do another one, a bit more complicated. Um, it's going to be, uh, so here we are, so I was assign a variable a equals cos x plus y plus minus y squared divided by 6. Right, so plot 3D, A, 
So the equation is uh, cos x plus y plus x squared divided by 6 minus y squared divided by 6. And then, yeah, I'll plot it now. So here we are. That's the equation. So these are three D plot, and like I said, if you don't put any, um, if you don't assign any ranges and stuff, you will just do it from minus, uh, from minus ten to ten, automatically, right? And then, <clears throat> then if you do your usual, um, like plot three D, cos x, sorry, and that's essentially the same. So it's pretty much straightforward, and um, what you need to do is just load your packages. <coughs> Sorry, your packages that I've done here, and um, yeah, then just continue doing the same thing and plotting your three D plots. But then, also this part of the code that from SimPy import with asterisks, that's so important because then you'd get all your uh, the functions like your cause functions and all that, and then your symbols as well. Like since I've assigned the symbols, then I can use them here, right? So that's important as well to do that. You know, don't leave that out. You can use any variable you want. You can you can use a, b, c, d. You can use whatever you want. Yeah, essentially. Um, but just make sure that you assign 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 that. Yeah. So hopefully this is helpful for anyone else. Um, for everyone else out there. So thank you guys and uh, have a good day.